please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Title, working with directories in Python, OS.System, RCDFU, and OS.Stir. Introduction In Python, you can manipulate directories and change your current working directory using the OS.System, RCDFU, command or the OS.Stir, function. These are essential tools for managing files and directories within your Python scripts. In this tutorial, we will explain how to use both methods, provide code examples, and discuss when to use each one. Pros Cons Pros Cons Code example Let's create a code example to demonstrate how to use both methods to change the current working directory. In this example, we create a directory, change the working directory using both methods, and then check the current working directory. Finally, we clean up by removing the created directory. Conclusion In Python, you can change the current working directory using either os.system, rcdfu, or os.stir. The choice between these methods depends on your specific use case. If you need to run other shell commands alongside changing the directory, os.system is the way to go. If you only need to change the working directory directly from your Python script, use os.stir. Make sure to select the method that best suits your needs when working with directories in Python. Chat GPT Title a guide to changing directories in Python, OS.System, RCDFU, versus OS.Stir. Introduction Changing directories is a common task in file and directory manipulation when working with Python. There are two primary methods to change directories in Python, using the OS.System, RCDFU, approach and the OS.Stir, function. In this tutorial, we will explore both methods, explain their differences, and provide code examples to help you choose the one that suits your needs. Method 1, OS.System, RCDFU The OS.System, RCDFU, method allows you to change the current working directory by executing a command through the system's command line. This method is not recommended for a few reasons. Platform dependency, it relies on the system's shell or command prompt, which means it may behave differently on different platforms, Windows, Linux, Mac OS. Limited error handling, it's challenging to capture and handle errors that occur during the directory change. Security risks, using OS.System, with untrusted user input may expose your application to security risks, as it can execute arbitrary commands. Here's an example of how to use OS.System, RCDFU. Method 2, OS.Stir. The OS.Stir function is a Python built-in method that provides a more reliable and platform-independent way to change directories. It's a safer and preferred method for changing directories within Python scripts. OS.Stir takes a single argument, which is the path to the directory you want to change to. Here's an example of how to use os.stir. Key differences and best practices. Now, let's discuss the key differences between these two methods and best practices for changing directories in Python. os.system, rcdfu. os.stir. Best practices. Example using os.stir Conclusion Changing directories in Python is a common task, and it's crucial to use the right method for the job. os.system, rcdfu, may work in some cases, but it's not recommended due to its platform dependency, limited error handling, and potential security risks. os.stir is the preferred method for changing directories within Python scripts, providing a more reliable and secure way to accomplish this task. 
ChatGPT.